I'm Addison Furrow, and today I'm going to be doing this guy's makeup. I don't know why I'm here. <laughs> um, today's look will be Halloween inspired due to the upcoming holiday. Send help, I've been kidnapped. <laughs> He's fine. I, no, I'm not okay. He's fine. I've been kidnapped, please send help. I'm in the studio currently. Wow, such a nice kidnapper. <laughs> <laughs> Send help! I need it! You look mad at me. Gee, I wonder why! Experimentation! <laughs> Hmm? He'll be okay. After therapy. <laughs> I think I'm gonna need more than therapy for this. Just a tiny, tiny, tiny bit. Okay. Just for the... Ah! Angel. For the content. Don't I look fantabulous? Conclusion. Never let this Nimrod do anyone else's <laughs> makeup. <laughs> you take the moon and you take the sun. You take everything that seems like fun. You stand up and then you're done. Rada, 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 rada. So come on in, feel free to do some looking. Stay a while, cause something always cooking. Good morning, and welcome to your accent for Wednesday, October 26th. I'm Caden Shegog, here at Kayla's Collins. Let's get it started. To all students and staff, tickets for the playoff game against Perry this Friday night are on sale now. Adult tickets are $10 and student tickets are $8. To purchase tickets, go to ohsaa.org slash tickets. Click on football, go down to Division II Region 11, and click Get Tickets to our next game. Student season passes are not valid for this game, so students must purchase a ticket. Go Tigers, beat Perry. Now let's check in with Mr. Lottenschlager and Ms. Bushman to learn more about the PBIS awards. Good morning and welcome to our first edition on accent related to choosing names for those students who have had perfect attendance for 21 straight days, as well as we're choosing names for students in the building that have had zero infractions, disciplinary infractions, for the first nine weeks. I am David Lottenschlager. This is Sam Bushman. We are here to bring to you just some information related to perfect attendance and that drawing, as well as are uh, names for the zero infraction. So please pay attention as your name very well might be drawn. Now, with that being said, just some information and, and, and some data for you. We have had in the first nine weeks, we have had 934 students with zero infractions. Zero infractions. That is approximately 80% of our student population that have had zero infractions. That is impressive. Uh, give yourselves a hand. Uh, we are very, very proud of you for that. The majority of those, of those nine of those uh, disciplinary infractions that we've had, the disciplinary infractions that we're getting, guys, are cell phone violations. 
That is the majority of the issue that we're having. And here's what I'm telling you as a building principal. Your teachers prepare lessons and instruction to, for you that is meant to make you better when you are here and to Im improve and bring you knowledge within the content area that they teach. They spend a lot of time making sure that the assessments, the quizzes, the homework, all of their instruction is on point for you. The very least that you can do is just stay off your cell phones and put your earbuds away. Uh, the majority, like I said, of our disciplinary infractions are of the cell phone variety or earbud variety. So if that's what we're working with, make sure you pay attention to that uh, detail so that you can be in the drawing for next time. So what we're going to do is this. I'm going to turn it over to Mrs. Miss Bushman. We are going to choose 10 names from an envelope of students that have had perfect attendance for 21 days. That attendance period is from September 19th through October the 18th. We are planning to do this every single month. So just in case you don't win right now, you've got next month that potentially I'll be back or an, another person or a principal will be back with another teacher to, uh, to pull these names and, and so that you can redeem your prize. Everything that we're giving out today are $10 gift cards. So we're giving away 30 $10 gift cards, 10 students, for perfect attendance and 20 students uh, that have had zero infractions out of our 934 students. So without further ado, our drum, wall, our drum roll, which you cannot hear at this point, right. our drum roll is now starting quietly in the studio. I'm gonna turn it over to Ms. Bushman to select those students and then tell you what to do if your name is called. All right. We've got our first name to draw for attendance. We have Natasha Keener. Congratulations, Natasha. We've got Jaden Jones. Congratulations, Jaden. Joshua Henderson. Angelo Salvino. Braley Grant. Congratulations, Braley. Addison Ferrero. That's one. we're going on number seven. <laughs> okay. You're teaching English, right? Right, I don't do math. Your math. Christopher Fair. Congratulations, Chris. This is number eight. Yeah. Donnie Lee Foster. All right, Donnie Lee. Uh, Taya Bodie. Where are we at right now? One, two, three, nine. All right, one more. Last one. Anna Rivera. Congratulations to Anna Rivera and our other 10 names that were drawn. Again, those are our attendance names that we've pulled out of. And the way they are chosen is there's a, a whole bunch of names inside of this. Ms. Bushman has just selected 10 inside of that. That's for students that have perfect attendance in that range of time. And we realize that there's medical emergencies. We know that there's doctor's appointments, but there's a direct correlation, just so that you're aware, there's a direct correlation between passing grades and just being in school. If you are here, our teachers and colleagues and staff can get you through, but you've gotta be here. So congratulations to those students that have uh, successfully been here for 21 straight days. Again, we'll do another drawing again in, in a few more, in another month for more names, just make sure that you're here. We're gonna move a little bit now towards our uh, infractions side of it. We're gonna choose 20 names out of those 934 students that have had zero infractions. Again, all of these names have had zero infractions. We're gonna select, ten, or select 20 of them. If you hear your name, please see Mrs. Parr um, at some point today. All right. Here we go. First it's be a little up, harder to keep track of. Yes, <laughs> you're gonna have to count. First up, we have Katie Hout. 
Congratulations, Katie. We've got Camden Lynch. Congratulations, Camden Lynch. Uh, Serenity Kemp. Congratulations, Serenity. I'm going to go with Victoria Ann Hutchison. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah, that's cut a little weird. <laughs> Victoria Ann Hutchison. <laughs> Sorry for saying your middle name in there. <laughs> Kylie Hardesey. Congratulations, Kylie. Uh, Kaylee Eberhardt. Congratulations, Kaylee. Andrew Garza. Congratulations, Andrew. Dakota Jennings. Congratulations, Dakota. Thanks for having no discipline infractions the first nine weeks. Connor Lanning. Lanning, Lanning. Yep, Connor Lanning. Tyler Hackenbrack. Nice job, Tyler. Halfway through. All right. Hannah Studer. Congratulations, Hannah. Jeremy Guides. Guides? We're going to go with Jeremy Guides. Okay. Sounds good. Trenton Campbell. Congratulations, Trenton. Clayton Smith. Congratulations, Clayton Smith. I really got to stir him up. Miriam Joseph. Congratulations, Miriam. Cadence Lancaster. Cadence Lancaster, congratulations. Final four. All right. Andrew Cottrell. Congratulations, Andrew. Amanda Watkins. Congratulations, Amanda Watkins. Thank you for your great behavior. Last two. Last two. All right, Terrence Anderson. And finally, I'll really dig down in the bottom there. Give it a shake. You know, I gotta get it. Be afraid to shake it. All right, let's, uh... all right, last one. It is Alicia Kalel Carrillo. Alicia Kalel Carrillo. Those are our 20 names selected in addition to our attendance, perfect attendance. Those are the 20 names with no disciplinary infractions. That concludes the very first edition of the PBIS, working with attendance, trying to improve our, our, our discipline side of it again. A lot of those things came on the cell phone side, but congratulations to our 20 students selected. Congratulations to our 10, to, 10, 10 students selected. Please see Mrs. Parr throughout the day today to redeem your $10 gift card. We will do this again in a month. We're excited to bring back our second edition of this in a month. We will see you soon. Thank you and have a great day. Thank you, Mr. Lonschlager and Ms. Bushman. Congratulations to all of our winners. Any boys interested in playing basketball this winter, please stop and talk to Coach Hose Combs or Smith in room C215. Tryouts start this Friday, October 28th at 3 p.m. You must have a current physical and final forms all completed prior to the first day of tryouts. Have you ever thought about competing in winter track and field? Watch this. Are you interested now? To any winter track and field athletes, are you looking for competition? Are you looking to improve your speed, power, agility, and endurance? Then please attend a meeting next Tuesday, November 1st, in room C101. No experience is required. See Coach Scott for more info. To any girls interested in gymnastics, there will be a brief meeting at 210 tomorrow in the cafeteria for any girl interested in trying out for the Tiger Gymnastics team. Today's lunch is chicken or cheese quesadilla, salsa, pinto beans, and fruit. Happy birthday to Alexis Fisher, Brock Jenkins, Joseph Kulisar, and Tayshawn Smith. Thank you for watching today's Accent. I'm Calix, here with Caden, and we'll see you all on Friday.